Welcome back to physics classes. Today we are going to discuss about electricity. Electricity is a flow of electrical power or charge. It is a secondary energy source which means that we get it from conversation of another sources of energy like coal, natural gas, oil, nuclear power and other natural sources which are called primary sources. This electricity is flow of electrical power or charge. This electricity is a secondary source which means that we get from another byproduct. It is a byproduct of another product. We get this electricity from coal, natural gas, uh, water, rainwater harvesting or turbines and uh, solar power, solar energy. We get from this electricity. Now, where does electricity come from? Electricity comes from power stations which supply high electricity for appliances like fridge, TV, cars. It means electricity come in two ways that is in minute and macro. Here minute are for battery cells like remote cars, remotes, mouse, shell, laptops and this electricity which is needed for fridge, TV, car which will connect our home meters. This electricity will come from the major power stations which has supply of high electricity. Next, uses of electricity. People use electricity for lighting, heating, cooling, refrigeration and for operating appliances like computers, electronics, machinery and public transportation systems. And we also see that electric vehicles, EV stores. Next, advantages of electricity. It is clean, safe, cheap and convenient source of energy lower maintenance cost, it is more efficient, no tailpipe emission, we all know that it can be set up in many sizes, it doesn't require as many as employees, reduces greenhouse emission, makes barely any pollution compared to other ways of creating or generating elect electricity, relative low maintenance cost, hydroelectric station are inexpensive to operate, hydroelectricity produces no gas emissions or waste. A station which can operate and run for long periods of time, it's renewable energy. It means until where sunlight or water flow will be, until then electricity is renewable. But so sunlight and as sunlight and water are renewable, so electricity is also a renewable resource. Next, disadvantages of electricity. It is more expensive than gas line. Loss of fish species as we keep the turbines inside the rivers sometimes messes up with wildlife in the forest areas. It is sometimes depend on the precipitation as dew drops may cause harm to the electric wires. More power plants are and more pollution. As we create some electricity with coal and gas, it creates more pollution and damming can cause loss of land suitable for agriculture as well as recreation. We use this electricity for different, we use this electricity, we make this electricity in different places so it causes land of agriculture as well as recreation, cost of construction, change in river or steam color quality, an electric vehicle is not completely emission free. In electricity there are limited number of feasible sites for large number of dams Drought can affect power production. Hydroelectric, hydroelectric natural seasons changes in rivers and ecos, ecosystems can be destroyed. Hydroelectricity means the electricity produced by water. Thank you. Please like this video, share and subscribe to our channel. That's steady to IIT. Have a great day.